Welcome to my chefin. My name is Chef Fran. And if you're new to this channel, welcome. And if you're returning back, thank you for coming back. But first, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and like button so you can have fresh new content from me every single week. Let's go to warm weather together and make a pineapple mango, or you could say mango pineapple, whichever you like, smoothie. Come make it with me. So we've added some of our almond milk in here. So now we're going to add our pineapples. And we have some mangoes in here. We're going to add some honey for a little sweetness. I'm adding some protein collagen powder to here and we're going to add a little bit of oatmeal for thickness and as well as for some fiber. About two and a half spoons. One, two, oh, let's make it three. And some ice that I have. Frozen mangoes, A, C, E, K, and folate. Frozen pineapples, B6, C, copper, folate, manganese, potassium, and thiamine. Honey, calcium, manganese, niacin, pentothenic acid, and potassium. Oatmeal, B1, manganese, biotin, and it's high in fiber. And protein powder, collagen, C, biotin, zinc, and contains amino acid. And now we're going to make our smoothie. Look how that's working out really great. Becoming a nice thick smoothie. And here are our list of ingredients. Look at our pineapple mango smoothie. Look at that. Nice and thick. Pouring this. Yum. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Inflation continues to put considerable strains on grocery budgets, especially among lower income households. So we have our resident taste tester, Gio here, who's gonna let us know how this mango pineapple, pineapple mango, however you wanna say it, smoothie is tasting. Well, let's see. Well, you definitely taste the mango in there and the pineapple sort of balances it out, so it's not too sweet but it's also pretty sweet it's also very refreshing with the oatmeal makes it pretty thick which is also nice geo's right so the oatmeal we have our nice great dose of fiber in here we have our vitamin c's from the pineapple as well as the mango so let me have a taste definitely really nice and refreshing like geo said so you know in the morning after your run if you had one or you know just an afternoon snack or just something refreshing this is a really nice treat to make um always remember that when you use frozen fruit it does kind of lose some of its natural sweetness from fresh from the fresh fruit because of the ice that it, you know has formed around it so it kind of tones down some of the sweetness for us it's perfect you know because we want more of the refreshing aspect of it and not the overabundance of sweetness but if you're someone who really likes sweet things you may want to add a lot more honey um, but it is perfect for us and we want you to definitely try this out let us know in the comment how it turned out for you and we hope you enjoy it because mm, definitely one of these hot summer days as the temperature is rising you definitely want to have this smoothie in hand so we thank you so much for hanging out with us today. We will see you in our next video. And remember, most of all, be good to yourself and God bless you.